one guy who has been one of the most physically gifted as it relates to passing ability as uh, quarterbacks go in the past generation is Drew Brees. He's the current leader in all-time passing yardage. He's been out for six weeks now, and he's right on track. Mahomes may be ridiculously ahead of schedule. Brees right on schedule to be back six weeks after injuring his thumb against the Rams. He had surgery on that thumb, had a brace installed inside the thumb, and let's listen to Breeze explain whether or not he will be back this weekend when the Saints host the Arizona Cardinals. Are you going to play this week? That's the plan. We'll see. What, what will go into your decision? Is it your decision? Just making sure I can be me. Is it strictly your call or is it the whole organization? What will go into the whole final decision to see if you play? I think I'll tell Sean if I'm ready and he'll believe me. Do you feel like you're 100% now? I mean, or is that fair to say throw in the ball? We're getting there. Oh, he's going to play on Sunday. Put, put me down for Drew Brees' is playing. If he's on your fantasy team, get ready to put him back in the lineup and get ready to dump Teddy Bridgewater unless and until Brees gets injured again because I have a feeling... I, look, I, I was told a few weeks ago that the Cardinals game is the target and everything that... And that little smile, that kind of knowing, understanding, I think he's back on Sunday, Chris. Well, I, the, the big thing is, and I understand Drew Brees wanting to come back. I mean, of course he wants to play and, and he wants to get going himself. He'd probably like to get a game under his belt before he starts the bye week, right? To kind of just take that angst away. Okay, I got one under my belt, got some reps. But uh, but the big thing, too, would be about his ability to practice this week. Like, if he can't full-fledged go out and practice, I'm not so sure I'd want to throw him out there on Sunday. Uh, you know, again, Again, with a thumb injury, it's not easy to, you know, replicate playing quarterback that way. You're not going to get a lot of full speed reps and make all the throws you can because you're dealing with that. And I'm sure he's getting close to it. But with a bye week coming, I just look at it and go, man, as Arizona, you're clearly the better team. And I understand Arizona's on a little roll and certainly a little more dangerous than we thought. But uh, I, I would err here on just let's take it through the bye week, come back, have a really good full week of practice for your next game. And then we're on. And Drew Brees is back on. And it's the Atlanta Falcons. And he can kick their butt. And then the Saints are, you know, back to who they're supposed to be. Yeah, the Saints have two bye weeks. They have a bye week, and then they have the Falcons. But uh, <laughs> and, and and look, I mean, well, the Falcons fans can't be upset about that. The team stinks this year. Yes. But I, I I think that the Cardinals. Here's the thing: the Cardinals are better than what we thought they were a few weeks Definitely. ago. They've won three in a row. Now they've beaten three of the worst teams in the league, but still, they're dangerous potentially. And maybe you can just ride your defense and outscore them that way. But, but here's the bottom line: Breeze is going to want to play, and. Uh, you know, you put him back out there and see what he can do. And they have doctors. They can check him out. And, and if he's confident that he's ready to go, he's ready to go. How much does he really need to practice, Chris? I mean, the guy knows the offense inside and out. And Sean Payton will have a game plan ready to go for Drew Brees. You know, you know yeah. Sean's capacity. He'll Definitely. have a game plan ready for Brees. He'll have a game plan ready for Bridgewater. Uh, and however it goes, it goes. Yeah, no, you, I mean, you're right. Like the mentality part of it, the mental part, all those things. I'm not worried about Drew Brees in that, in that capacity in, in, any, in any shape way or form I mean he's fine there but even still Drew Brees first ballot hall of famer legend all of that you know to not get full speed reps during a week and then just go out and play I don't care who you are that's going to be tough you know all of a sudden oh wow I got to throw like a 20 yard out route and there's somebody in my face and things like that you know th those are things you'd like to practice at least a few times somewhat to replicate I know you can't fully do that in practice on a Friday or a Thursday uh, you know to its complete way as far as guys hitting you but still you'd like to get that timing that rhythm that feel of you know the ball popping out of your hand to where you know so hopefully on Sunday when that guy is wide open you don't miss the throw because it's the first time you've really gone oh let me put the pedal to the metal here and throw a 20 yard out route because I got to put this ball you know on the money that's that's the aspect I worry about more than anything for a guy like Drew Brees mentally and the game plan you're right he'll be all over it Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.